I originally, like most people, started out wanting to draw comics. My work over the years has been everything from drawing to producing to directing to writing across the board. I was all over Europe, did some work with the States, Australia. I worked on a films like Land Before Time, All Dogs Go to Heaven. And since coming home to Ireland, I've basically been moving myself towards live action, really, and, and still involved in animation, still designing. They used to say that they had 100,000 bad drawings in it before you get one good one in animation. I think I'm up to 65,000, maybe 50,000. I'm not sure where I am, but I haven't reached 100,000 yet. I don't think you ever reach it. But it's that way of thinking, you know, you're always learning. Our pencils have changed. They're all digital, really. You know, it's not really done on paper as much anymore. It's like saying to a guitar player, you know, what guitar did you use? It, it doesn't matter. That's part of it. What is, is in is the, what they can do. My old man drove a truck. I wasn't going to drive a truck. I wasn't, I'd rather, if I'm going to stay up all night working, it's not going to be driving up a roadway in the nighttime. It's going to be sitting, drawing pictures, which I prefer doing. And that got me thinking, and I went to England to work with Dick Williams, and I spent all my time in the British Museum looking at our stuff in their boxes and wondering why is our stuff in their boxes in that country. And then I started reading up on Irish mythology and history, and I didn't really care when I was here, I guess. You know, I was into punk, music, having a laugh, having a crap about mythology. But I did when I was away, because you kind of your, your identity slips. And I think when I came back, I sort of said, wouldn't it be great if we could do our own stories? And I met other people who thought the same. And I had these couple of drawings of this little kid and as a warrior, and, and I sort of developed it. So by about 95, I had the idea, like at that point, this could be an animated film. But Cullen is a weird character. And he, to me, he's like the psyche of us, you know? And I thought, this is what Cullen could be. It's better to do it in live action. Plus, the story lends itself better to live action. People thought I was mad, and they still think I'm mad. I mean, I live in a field in water, you know, and I want to make a $50 million film. I mean, is that mad or what? Yeah, it is mad, but you know, so what? If I got to make Hook Island, I'd happily retire. I'd just disappear. That's the way I feel. If I could make that bloody thing the way I want, with the people I'd like to get. And uh, that's a statement then, like, you know, I've got all my bits and bobs in there. Um, that would be fun. I've been working on it for half my life, but it's only really starting now.